The race of the weekend at Arapahoe Park was an all-star Arabian showdown in the Jerry Parton Cobra Sprint sponsored by Quarter Moon Ranch. The field of eight for the six furlong stakes race included rising star Patty's Day against champion mayor Miss Dixie and former horse of the year So Big Is Better. Gates open the Jerry Parton Cobra Sprint sponsored by Quarter Moon Ranch is underway with Abbott from the outside into Jet Sun in the center breaking on top and vying for the early lead. Patty's Day in the red cap is a length behind in third place, although Kelsey Purcell wasting no time and now shooting Patty's Day through to grab the lead. Miss Dixie's in fourth place on the inside of So Big Is Better, and then Chindaka Express, RB Rich, and Zell's Bells is a long way last. How good is the young Patty's Day? He's taken the lead past the half mile pull, grabbed hold of the bit, and opened up two and a half lengths on Miss Dixie in second. The Jet Sun is in third. Scott Powell train runners are one, two, three. So big is better. The gray and the green silks with the white sleeves in fourth with seven lengths to make up on the inside of Abbott. And then RB Rich, Chindaka Express, and Zell's Bells past the quarter pole in this all-star Arabian showdown and the rising stars in front of the champion mayor. Patty's Day with the lead pursued by Miss Dixie, former horse of the year. So big is better. A long way back in third place and then to Jet Sun inside the final hundred yards. Patty's Day, a star in the making, has grabbed hold of the baton of Arabian Racing, pursued gamely by Miss Dixie, but no match for Patty's Day. The future, Patty's Day and Kelsey Purcell win the Jerry Parton Cobra Sprint over Miss Dixie, RB Rich, so big is better in fourth, one minute 19.02 seconds for six furlongs. The sky is the limit for Patty's Day. He will now represent Colorado and Arapahoe Park in the second leg of the new Arabian Triple Jewel. The Sheikh Zayed bin Sultan Al Nayan Cup, part of the Sheikh Mansur Global Arabian Horse Flat Racing Festival, will be held at Oak Tree at Pleasanton in Northern California on July 5th. Patty's Day carries the colors of the Quarter Moon Ranch of Scott and Lori Powell, Jim Schleimer, and Nikki Forbes Robinson. The young four-year-old Colt is trained by Scott Powell and ridden by Kelsey Purcell. But Sunday was not just about the future of Arabian racing. The Cobra Sprint's namesake, longtime trainer Jerry Parton, was inducted into the Arabian Jockey Club Racing Hall of Fame and Tent of Honor in a ceremony held during the Cobra Awards dinner at Arapahoe Park on Sunday evening. He was very dedicated to, to the sport, to the Arabian. That's why this is a great honor. Not only was Jerry Parton a successful endurance rider and racing trainer in more than 40 years with the Arabian breed, but he influenced future trainers, like the one for Patty's Day. Scott Powell uh, was like a son and like a brother to me also. Um, was there all the time with him and passed the torch on to Scott. Same methods of training, the same little speeches, the same little, you know, in the windows. One of them is uh, take care of them, they'll take care of you. Uh, know your learn from your do's and your don'ts. Also inducted was Swade, an 18-time stakes winner in Canada and the United States from 1988 to 1992, owned by Roger Hoffert. A great horse, just like to run around, he'd break with everybody, back off and come around, look him over and come around and beat him all. The past and the future of Arabian racing.